Hi guys, it's Hani here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This cookie decorating tutorial is brought to you by RM International, a worldwide supplier of cookie cutters, kitchen gadgets, baking, and cooking supplies. RM International is giving away $20 gift card to one of you guys, so be sure to check the giveaway details in the description box under the video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make several insects. We're going to start with beetles. To make these cookies, I used Ladybug cookie cutter from RM International. And I'm gonna show you how to make three different beetles. Starting with green royal icing, make the head. I'm using 15 second consistency. Use a needle tool to distribute and shape the icing while icing is still wet. Let it crust for about 5-10 minutes and then use black royal icing to finish the head. Let that crust again and then use edible marker to draw the outline for the body or in this case these are the wings and then you can outline and flood with green royal icing. While still wet, pipe a black line in the center and then use brown royal icing and make the strips. Brown royal icing is also about 15 second consistency. After you're done piping all of the lines, use a needle tool to accentuate the points. Let it dry completely overnight and then use edible marker to finish the head. Now we can start working on the legs. For the legs I'm using dark green leaf royal icing and I'm going to make the legs in two steps. Starting with the first line of green royal icing and then we're gonna have to let that crust before piping a second line. Now make the antennas and this was the green striped beetle. Second beetle is very very popular, it's a ladybug. So we're gonna start again with a head but it's slightly different shape first. You can see I'm using a different shape but we're going to fill the corners with white. So I'm using black first and then come in with white. Use a needle tool to shape it while still wet. Let it crust for about 15 minutes and then you can make the body with red royal icing. With a ladybug, we're gonna use what's called wet on wet technique, making the dots while the red is still wet. Now use black royal icing, 15 second consistency, to finish the wings. Pipe a black straight line across and then let it dry completely. Finish by piping the legs just like we did with the green striped beetle before. And the last thing you have to do are the antennas. And there you have it, ladybug beetle cookies. The third beetle is going to be white, yellow and black. Starting with the head, using white royal icing. Take black royal icing and pipe the design directly onto the wet white and then try to mirror it on the right side. Use a needle tool to shape it if needed. And then we're gonna let this crust for about 5-10 minutes. 
Once crusted, you can use your edible marker to draw the outline for the wings and then use yellow royal icing 15 second consistency, outline and flood. Use orange icing to pipe zigzag line across and then needle tool to kind of blend it together. Here comes the tricky part. We're going to try to mirror left or right onto the left and left and left onto the right, wherever you're gonna start. So I'm starting on the right here, trying to mirror it on the left. And same thing here on the bottom. I'm using 15 second consistency black royal icing, piping directly onto the wet yellow icing. To finish the head, add a black layer at the very top and then let it dry completely. Once dried, you can start working on the legs. I'm using golden yellow royal icing. For the legs, I would recommend that you use icing that is slightly thicker, about 20 to 25 second consistency, so it doesn't spread on you too much and it holds its shape better. Once the first layer dries, you can add the second layer and your legs are finished. For the antennas, I'm going to use golden yellow and a little bit of black. And here are the yellow beetle cookies. And next design is a sting bug. I am using a turtle shaped cookie cutter. First, we need to draw the outline for the sting bug's body, making sure that you leave enough room around the body for the legs. Start by making the head with ivory royal icing. Make the eyes with black royal icing piping consistency and then you can make the bottom part of the body. I'm gonna let this crust for about 15 minutes and then finish the middle section. I'm gonna have to let this dry completely and then to finish the design I'm going to use light brown and dark brown edible markers. Take piping consistency, ivory royal icing and outline. Now we can start working on the legs. Legs are going to be made out of sections, so I'm gonna have to let each section crust before adding another section to it. To make the antennas, I'm also using ivory royal icing and I'm also going to add a little bit of uh, dark brown on there. And then use your needle tool to blend it together. Once you're done piping all the legs, let it dry for about an hour or so and then use edible marker to finish this design. And here are the finished cookies. These are the tastiest sting bugs you'll ever try and they don't even stink. Here is another design. I use the rocket chip cookie cutter to create ants cookies.
Here I'm drawing on cookies with edible marker and then we're gonna start with making the head with black realizing. Let it crust and then you can make thorax. Let it crust again and then make the other section and then at this time the head should be crusted. You can also add the eyes and antennas and start working on those legs. So once the thorax is dried, you can also add the abdomen. I think these turned out really cute, although I have to admit, I hope I will never have to deal with the size of an insect like this, because these are about four inches across. They are really cute on a cookie, but not so much in real life. And here is the last design. This is going to be a dragonfly. I'm gonna start with the head using hot pink foil icing. Let it crust and then you can make the thorax. Use a needle tool or a toothpick to shape the icing while still wet. Make the eyes. Then you can add abdomen. Dragonflies have a segmented abdomen, so I'm going to let this dry and then we're gonna add lines across. First though, we can make the wings with white royal icing, 15 second consistency. To finish the abdomen, add the lines across with hot pink royal icing and then to finish the wings, I'm using purple edible marker. And this is what the finished cookies look like. And here is the whole set of insects we just did. Beetles, sting bugs, ants and dragonflies. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Thank you so much to RM International for sponsoring this video. And don't forget to enter giveaway details. How you guys can enter are posted in the description box under the video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.